Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Ross, and it's time to talk about some diamond paintings. I have this bag of diamond paintings right here that DIY Choose sent me. They contacted me recently and want to know if I want to pick out some diamond paintings to share here on the channel from them, and I said yes. So I picked out some items, and I forgot to get them pulled up on my screen, so I'm doing that right now while I chit-chat with you. Um, DIY Choose is an online retailer that has diamond paintings and they also have cross stitch kits and I went through and picked out a few different diamond paintings from them I got some what did I pick out uh, off the canvas type thing a couple off the canvas things and then some on canvas partial drill full drill so we got a little bit of everything here from them so let's start off with the two off the canvas items everything straightened up and kind of figure out where it's what's going on okay so the first item we're gonna look at is very cool they got a few different styles to choose from and I've links to everything down below if you see something you like and you want to get one for yourself so let me get everything out of the package here so this first piece is ten dollars and sixty nine cents and this price is all of all um as of November 12th, 2023, when I'm recording this. So, prices may fluctuate and change in the future. So, here we have a Santa Claus head. It's kind of like a vintage Santa that has a couple spots right there, holes that you will hang it from. And then there. So, we don't diamond paint his face, but everything else we kind of like do different like highlights and accents on him. So like the holly berries and all the greenery and stuff will do. I thought that was really cool. Uh, the size on this is going to be about 8 inches wide and 9 inches tall. So a pretty good size piece. Um, the back side is plain. There's nothing on the back side. It's just printed on the front. So this comes with your standard tool kit. And inside this tool kit we have the chain to hang the diamond paint with so. and then we have our diamond painting pieces these are uh, rhinestone style we've got the smaller size pieces here so we got white oh, there's some red and green and then we got some larger size red ones which would be the holly berries I'll put in a picture right here of what it's gonna look like completed so you get an idea that is the first one I picked out. I'm trying to figure out where to put the box for this. It's right down here. Okay, so the next one we have is another off canvas, also another hanging piece. And I gotta say, this one's so nice, I picked it out twice. Um, I didn't realize it already had this diamond painting, but I do. But the good thing is, you know what, I love it so much, I have one I can have here at home, and I have one I can have at the office. So, I can have it all the time, I can see it, because I love Cardinals. And when I saw this, I loved it. So, here it is. So, it's just this little hanging wreath, it almost looks like a heart-shaped, I would say. But you got the Cardinal there in the center. You got some ornaments, then you got some holly berries and greenery all around. Really cool. I'll put a picture in right here of what it looks like completed so you can get an idea of what that would look like. Um, this is $10.39 right now over at DIY Choose. And this comes with the chain to hang it from. The hang it or the chain to hang it with. I love that piece. Uh, our toolkit. If you've never diamond painted before, everything you need is right here in this toolkit. So the pen you use to pick up the diamond pieces and place them on the piece. So the piece is all adhesive. There's a plastic layer you peel back. It's adhesive and the diamond pieces stick to that plastic. I feel like I'm going to sneeze for a second. Let it pass. I think we're good. 
Um, but what you do is you peel back the cover of this red wax and then you take the tip of this pen. It's kind of like a little indentation in it. And you collect some of that wax in the tip of the pen. And then that wax picks up the diamond pieces and puts it on the canvas. So the diamond pieces, I don't know if you can kind of see, the larger ones you can see, they are rounded at the top. Then they got a flat bottom. So that flat bottom sticks to the canvas, or in this case, the plastic. And that's how they adhere, is the self-adhesive on, they're the adhesive glue on the canvas, or the plastic. Get the this stuff back in the box. And then we're gonna look at some canvas pictures. So diamond paintings usually are either on a canvas or they're what we call off the canvas type craft project, which would be this kind of sort of this kind of thing. So the next two things are gonna be partial special shape drills. So this one you don't do the entire canvas, you only do part of it. And this one has some special shaped diamond pieces. So it kind of, that's why they call them like special shaped partials. Um, do this one here first. This is 30 centimeters by 30 centimeters is the canvas size. I think this one was fun. And it's a little rainbow dragon. So here is the little rainbow guy. Um, Four dollars and fifty nine cents for this. So you got all the different colors of the rainbow all over this dragon, and he on like this little moss covered rock. I thought this looked like fun. There you can see some of the special shaped pieces that go up there at the top. Then the rest are gonna be all your just standard style, standard shape diamond pieces. Uh, this one has, it's like 16 different colors we're going at. And with this one, it's only sticky where you put your diamond pieces. So the white background you don't do anything with, that stays as is. But then where you put the diamond pieces right here, it is sticky. And that's where your diamond pieces stick to is that. Yeah, I just thought this was a fun little guy. Lots of color, it'd be fun to do. So I picked that out. I feel like this is like the only non-Christmas, non-winter thing was this one right here. Everything else was kind of winter or Christmas themed. Right. There. I'll just stick it there. And then this next piece is also another partial drill, special shaped. It is called Christmas Green Kitten. And this is a green kitten. Um, uh, there's like a couple different styles of this one you can pick out and I picked out this one here. Another 30 by 30 centimeter. And look at that. So you got this green cat with a Santa hat and some presents behind them. And this one you're gonna do, looks like the one present you do a lot of diamond painting on, but everything else is kind of just like outline. Like do highlight the edges of it. The hat's got a lot of diamond paint in it, but you'll do stuff here and there. And then we have these star-shaped ones that we'll do in different spots on the canvases. So I'll put in a picture so you can see what everything looks like finished from the website so you get an idea of what the finished picture would look like. And that one is off the price. This was $4.59 for this one. $4.59 um, for that one. Then the last one we're going to do is, uh, I guess this would be considered your traditional diamond painting. Um, full canvas, regular drill. This one is $4.89 for this picture. It's a 30 by 40. And when I saw this picture, it just reminded me of when I was younger. And I could swear probably a Christmas card looked like this. I remember from my childhood. And I really like the picture, so I picked it out. And it is a toolkit. And here are the diamond pieces. These ones come in little zip top bags with the numbers on them. And then 
here is the picture. I love this picture. It's a nativity scene. So there we got the little baby and all the little baby farm animals around him and the angel. I just, I love this picture. I try to get without the glare so you can see. It's like, I've, I'm pretty sure like if I'd go back in time and at some point we received a Christmas card from somebody with this on the front. So when I saw this picture, I was like, I need to have this because it's really cool and it just brings back memories from my childhood. Um, there's also, if you go on to this page, they have another style that's included, which that one's a lot more cartoony and I'm not sure about that one, but this one, this one I love so much. So if you click on the link, make sure you select this one so you get the right one. But I love this picture. $4.89. It's 30 by 40. Um, I don't know if they have these saw ones. They don't usually have a completed picture of, but I'll do include the picture of like what it they have on their site of um, the picture itself before it's been, you know, made a diamond painting. So I kind of like the original picture is inspired by. What's also nice is when I was going through, they had this image from the canvas on the site so I could see how it looked like in diamond painting form or how the canvas looked before you did diamond painting on it. And it looked pretty good in this size. So I think this is going to be fine. Um, I think all these characters are pretty large and kind of centered focus. Not a lot of detail on them, so they should be fine. And diamond painting form. So that's something you gotta be careful with, like with these 30 by 40 and smaller size pictures that you don't have too much of a detailed picture on the canvas because you're gonna lose that detail when you do the diamond painting. It's, it's gonna get pixelated with the diamond painting, so I think this one's gonna look good the, with the pixelated style look. I mean, the canvas looks good itself, so I think it's gonna look great finished. I'm excited for this one. So. That is everything from DIY Choose. So I have links to everything down below. Thank you again, DIY Choose, for sending these to me. I love them. And I need to get like 12 more extra hours in a day to get all this diamond painting done that I want to because I've got so much stuff I want to work on. But I'm just so right now into all my diamond painting stuff. So I love it. So anyways, that is all. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you all again soon.